Yo, 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 what's up, Warriors and Wahines? You rocking with your boy Ryan Grice Mullins, and this is Mullin' Around. Check me out. Welcome back with another episode. I'm here with UH tennis player John Brooklyn. How you doing, my man? I'm good, I'm good. How are you? Good, good. So, man, I hear you from England. Yeah, I'm from uh, London. London, London, England. That's pretty awesome. So, I know you guys are big for, you know, the big tennis tournament, Wimbledon, right? Yeah. So, growing up as a kid, have that always been like a dream of yours to one day, you know, play in the big stage in front of your hometown? And Yeah, definitely. Yeah, I mean, you always watch it every year. It's always a huge spectacle for like the two weeks in an English summer. So, you know, watching Wimbledon was a big inspiration as a kid and something you always want to do later in life. So, bro. Where's your headband, man? I know you're known, you know, for your headband out here. You know, you got your little swag, got your wristbands, you know, got your tape, your socks, but no headband today. What's up with that? No, I mean, I just, yeah, I have my headband. I only wear it for the matches. It's my lucky headband, so, <laughs> yeah, I just, I just leave it for the matches, special okay. occasion. So, John, my man, I notice, you know, when I watch, you know, tennis on TV, I notice a lot of people grunting. You know, what, what's what's the grunting all about? You know, every time a ball's over here, they you know, ah, 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 you know. Are you a grunter yourself? You know, do you? you uh, I mean, I think I do a little bit, but, you know, the main grunt is the, the big guy over there. The big he guy. He makes a lot of noise. <laughs> and uh, there's always a lot of people walking past. They always take a lot of fun out of him when you, you hear him going past. And was, he makes a lot of noise. I don't know if it's necessary he makes that much noise, but I don't know, you get used to it. Ouch. With the big guy over there, I know you better get used to it real fast, huh? One of the things I know in collegiate man tennis is you guys go by the honor system. Is that correct? Yeah. You know. Yeah, you make your own calls. Yeah. You, you make your own calls, right? So, what I want to know is, I know you've been in a game where it came down to, you know, the ball landing in or out. You know, it's so close. You know, but the ball might have been a little bit in, but you. But do you make that call, uh, I'm going to call it out, you know, to make it a close game? Well, no, I mean, our coach is a, a stickler for being like a class act, an ambassador for the university, and, you know, the rules are there, you know, if you're not 100% sure, ball's in. But, I mean, you know, there's a lot of times where it happens. <laughs> where it happens. Yeah, I mean, there's a lot of teams that, you know, they want it so bad, they, you they, know. They make that call, They make huh? the call. I mean, sometimes you, can't, you can never tell what their intentions are, but, you know, it happens. But, you know, you've, you've just got to deal with it, you know. It's just the way it is. Craziest thing that ever happened to you during a match, you know? Would you got a story for me? Uh, yeah. Uh, last year we were playing a home against Michigan. And uh, as the match was playing, there was the softball game going on or something. And loads of softballs were coming over. And it was causing a huge distraction. But apart from that, um, a couple of my roommates came down uh, a little intoxicated, I think. Uh, they were making a lot of noise. It really upset my opponent. And, he couldn't handle it. I won the match, and <laughs> it was because of those guys on the side of the court. They get big help. I hey, couldn't handle it. Man, you better get them guys there <laughs> at every match. Man, I am battled pretty much everybody thus far. You know, I've you know I tried to hit hit off of rickets. You know, in the softball, I shot hoops. I've been pushed off the diving board. What you got for me? Man? I know you got something. Uh, why don't you get up there and I'll hit some serves, see if you can get one of those back. Alright, your bet is on. Oh yeah, I'm ready. John, I got much respect. <laughs> much respect, man. You got, you got some blazing, you got some blazing shots there, man. God, man, I just, I just want to thank John, you know, for you know letting me come out here and you know have fun with you and you know interact in your sport. And I, mean, I hope you had a great time because I did and everything. And uh, best of luck for the rest of the season. All right, thank you. No Thanks problem. All right.